Welcome to High Intensity Interval Training. So the official welcome to HEC class. If you haven't done so already, just, just start to shake, swing as I'm telling you what we're doing today. Big arm circles is a great thing to do. So what we're doing today for our timing interval is a whole shebang. So it's a regression. We're gonna start real big, like we're running up a mountain, and we're gonna go 45 seconds on, 16 exercises through. Once we finish that 16 exercises, we're gonna go to the top, of the mountain and it's going to be a little shorter we're only going to run halfway up or a little bit more so that's 35 to 30 seconds and then the last round when we do all 16 we're going 20. so you're really going to want that light heavy medium something that you can go endurance and sprint with so that's all we start with a little bit of warm-up and then we're going to dive into the that 16 exercises i still can't find my little remote so we're rocking with my phone if i'm grabbing it so if you already did those arm swings, let's turn it into leg swings. So standing on top of that one foot, just go ahead and let that one foot stay stationary. And then the other foot just goes to as far in flexion to extension. Hip flexion, hip extension. Ah, and there's where you just kind of take a nice deep breath and let all your day go. Okay, other side. Woo. Letting any tension go, get it nice and warm. Beautiful leg swing on that other side. All right, let's dive into center squats. So pushing your hips back, going your own pace. Knees and lava toes, just all that good stuff. Try to keep the chest up. Go slow. Yes, good pace. We'll have plenty of time to go fast. Let's take a little bit of a slow approach. Lunges. So big stride back. Think about that knee and line with toe. This is our prep. This is our prep for our workout. So if we're thinking about knee and line with toe, when we warm up for our workout, our body will automatically go to that. Lightning forward, <laughs> waking up the ankles. Yeah. Nice, y'all. Four more. Four, three, two. Now stand tall. Frankenstein. Reach for the toes. Keep that chest up. Practice those shoulders being down and anchored. Woo. Four more. Four, three, two. Side to side lunge. So step it wide. Out, then center. You're on pace. I'm already feeling a little winded, but that just might be me. Ah, side to side lunge, how good. And four, three, two, and last one. Squat holds at the bottom, go into inch work. Back of your mat, crawl it on out, hold, get it on back in. I want you to repeat that. Down to the floor, out and in. If you're not going for wrist flexion today, you can either go on a couch and reverse that walkout to be your feet walk in instead of your arms. That is something that is a okay. Four more counts, inch arm. So we'll probably get about one. One more out, one more in. Good, standing tall. Let's take it a wood chop. Wide feet. Go and hide the low. Get a little rotational warm up. Nice. Four more. Now let's switch it. Other side. Wide feet. Hide the low. We won't have wood chops today. But we will have anti rotational movement. So we're nice and warm for that now. Three, two, one. All right, team, let's get our set. No pun intended. That came out of nowhere. Okay, 16 exercises. It will feel a little bit like a brain teaser the first time through. We got a 15 second transition to help us get, get us through that. First exercise is a shuffle, shuffle, drop. No weight equipment needed. Optional side to side. So everyone start low. Now I want you to go quick feet. We're trying it out. If this feels okay, you want to add on quick, quick, down. This is lateral shuffle, okay? You can alternatively go down and up in place. Depends on how much space you have and what 
people want to work. But feet is cardio and drop is more legs. Top of the mountain or bottom of the mountain. <laughs> yes, on our marks, 45 seconds. Get ready, set, and go. So we're low. Ah, this is where we start to kick it into that high gear. Try to stay low the entire time. Quick, quick, down. Quick, quick, down. Quick, quick, down. They're tiny steps. Tiny little steps. Tiny little steps. Quick. Nice. Now, one, add your own flavor to that. Doesn't matter how many. You might have a living room that you want to conquer, right? You might be in a teeny tiny space. Stay low. We're doing this for five more seconds till we hit exercise number two. Grab your weights, single or double, lateral lunge, bicep curl, alternating. All right? Ah, five seconds. That 15 second transition is good. Ready? Here we go. Lateral, center. If you're using a single weight, I want you to switch arms. A little bit of coordination there. Switch center. Switch center. All right. If you're rocking that double weight, step, make sure that hip is doing the work. Good. How's this for a warm up? Ugh. Moving into it. Two of 16. 10 seconds to go. Let's go for this hill. Next one's gonna be on the floor, team. Three, two. No weight needed. On the floor. Plank thread the needle. Hold me here. One foot comes in. Alternate tap. Setting it on up. If you prefer not to come to the on your flexion arms today, do the same thing, but mountain climbers. Everyone. Here we go. We're on. Hands on your shoulders. This is stability. But go through the whole chest, head stays above the shoulders. Make sure you have room. This one's not about the speed. It's all about full range of motion. Take your time, team. The weight is in the foot that stays in the plank. And in the hand that stays in the plank. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Pop up, no weights. Options. Hop scoop or step scoop or weight if you want. Front, walk. Let's go forward and back. Ready, set, here we go. I'll show where I ended. This is the lunge walk or squat walk. I'm staying in that squat the entire time. Stepping. Big steps. You never have to leave the floor. Two front, two back, or I like the scoot. Ah, quick steps. Big hops are more than welcome. Woo! That will get you jazzy in the legs. Five more seconds, your style. Three, two, one, squat press. Ooh, enjoying that 15 seconds? It's feeling a little longer, shorter. Top load, squat, single arm or double press. Beginning in three, two, one, lock and load. Up, up. We're on team, single double. Knowing that these are grouped by legs, yeah? We just did that lateral lunge and the jump scoop. Focusing on overhead press is up to you. Full body strength, isolated strength. What you going for? I like a little go today. Ooh, 10 seconds now, team. We are well into the hill. Three, two, one, deadlift weight. Something to hinge or swing. 
That's what we're doing. Change your swing. Shoulders down and back. Hinging at the hip. Deadlift 45 seconds. Our power swing. On our marks. Three, two, one. Here we go. Hinge it. Start to warm up. So if I could cue you through this workout, I would say longer sets, like 45 seconds, is a great time to go heavy and not as much power. So you can eyeball in that heavy duffel bag or something in your room. Now's the time. Grab both of them. Anything. Right? It's 45 seconds. It's endurance. Good. Keep going. 10 seconds left here. If you're swinging and you love cardio, that's good too. Five seconds, three seconds, weight down. Here we go. Okay, how you sprint? I want that knee coming up somewhere between knee and hip height and a forward lean. Or friends who are not doing that impact today, alternating lunges, optional weight. I'll give you a second. Let's start in three, two, one. Here we go. Sprinters, we're going for a little more cardio here. Arms are moving. Quick turnover. No, we have three rounds. So maybe you're like, I'll do that sprint thing on the 20. You got that weight center loaded, alternating. Beautiful lunges here. Some sort of cardio boost in the for 10 more seconds. We are almost to the halfway point of that hill. I know that we have started a little bit of work here. Three, two, one. Weights down. Reverse lunge, top option. So those of you who have just done lunges, I feel for you. I'll give you another option. Reverse lunge, hop, or roll to the toe. Ready, set, here we go. Down, up, down, up, my friends. We're just doing lunges. Let's just do a static knee tap, weights and hands. So we got journeys along this hill. Some of us are attacking it up. Some of us are going to that side edition of steeper and heavier strength of cardio. Second side, we'll do in a bit. This is all one side. All one side, stay on this side. Yes. Ooh. If you are alternating, you will live. We will do another set where you can alternate. Three, two, one. Okay. Whoa. Second side. Hello. If you are alternating, just do it again. Reverse lunge hop or half. Okay. Two, one. Here we go. Step it back. Roll to the toe. Trajectory is going. Up. Yeah, up. Good. Press that bone of the foot into the heel, into the floor. Accelerate up. Nice. Stay low when you're in that lunge or squat. 20 more seconds. Woo! Just feeling the legs. Don't worry. Core, arms are ready for us in 10 seconds. Woo! Five seconds. Three, two, one. Side plank to the floor or a push up. Check it. So we're gonna do a side plank push up. It's a combo. Come to the side plank, knees or toes. Knees or toes, push up. Alternate sides. Everyone who that looks groovy to, I want you to start. Go. Knees, beautiful. Push up in the center. Those of you who are looking for a different journey, I want you to go bridge, chest press. We are working the chest either way. So, bridge it up, single, double, chest press up to you. You got 45 seconds to explore that journey. This is a little spiel on the floor. We will be here on the floor for 10 more seconds. So keep going that big, great push. Five seconds, I'm gonna ask you to get up off the floor. So inch form it, relax, inch form it, get up there quick, jack the press. 
I know. Remember that patting head and tummy I was talking about? Might feel quick. Okay, jack to press. Options. Ready, set. Here we go. Ever long squat with me. Press it out. Alternating legs. If you want, you can bring it to that jack press. Tiny hop out and in as you keep those elbows narrow with slightly in front. Come on, team. We are almost conquered the longest mountain of the day. So we're gonna stick in it. Three, two, two, hinging, hinging, twice, check it, hinging, static hold, weights go out to the side. On our mark, get set, here we go. Boom. Control or jump weight. I like to talk about like almost like a bow and arrow. Their arms aren't straight out of the board, but they're not bent like a table. More like a nice classic bow where your palms are facing each other and your shoulders back here are doing the work without flaring. So much to think about. Just think easy. Hang in. Soft elbow. Good. 10 seconds more. Between the shoulder blades, please. Five seconds more like that. We will go to the floor. Option for plank row. Three, two, one. Options here. You don't want to hit anymore. One side, but you'll have to switch halfway. Or plank row on the floor. Quadruped or plank. Set it up. Three, two, one. Here we go. Hold. Hold. Wherever you are pulling, you are getting this asymmetric pull. Walk forward, that shoulder opening up. Keep it even. Use your lat. Yeah, use your core to lock that shoulder and hip straight. Beautiful. You're halfway if you're doing one side. Keep going if you're alternating. Ten seconds. We're gonna roll the weights towards the side in five, three, two, one. Option burpees. You can be here. Step it in. Step it in. Roll to the toe. To the floor. Step it out. Step it out. Then repeat or hop. Burpees with a hop. Ready, set. Here we go. So down and up. And my friends, you don't prefer the journey where your head is tilted. I have a suggestion. It's this, the squat jump. You get quicker turnover in the legs. That might be a tiny more cardio boosting in a different way. 20 seconds, I want you to go with a burpee option, impact or not, or squat jumps. Ooh, high burpee hill, high burpee hill. Whenever you see the burpee, you know you have two more exercises to go. Three, two, one, off the burpee hill, to the floor for the last two. Hip cross, leg drop. Whoa, we hit the flow. Legs together. Starting here, hips pull up, legs drop. The legs can be bent or straight. Join me. Set it up. Here we go. Anchor the elbows. Relax the neck. Peel the hip off the floor. One thrust, one drop. Go to the place where you feel like the abdominal wall is challenged to keep your back from resting. That's your range. The beautiful set of 45 seconds has five more seconds to go. Stay on the floor in three, two, one. Bicycles. Check it. Staying on the floor. Alternate legs going out. Actually, add that twist. Set it on up. Three, two, 
One, here we go. Pivot through the torso. You got 45 seconds. So let's approach this one slow. Out, hold. Out, hold. Out, hold. It's like you're really trying to reach that opposite elbow instead of just reaching, shoving it there. Doing that full body rotation. You might not touch it. 20 seconds to go. Optional twist with the body. I want you to focus on that extension, keeping that neutral back. Five seconds, we made it to the top of the hill. So keep bicycling to the top. Beautiful. Ah, oh, come on up. Oh, 16 beautiful exercises, team. Ah. Every time you will see them, they will be the same, but it will feel different. Because check it, let's get our heavier weights out if you have them, or if you want to explore that today. We have the opportunity for 35 seconds. Let me make sure I said 35, not 20, and 30. Why? Because I worked, I said 30. I worked out the class timing of what we would finish, and that means 30 seconds is too much shorter than 45. So go heavy, starting at the top. We don't start with weights. Make sure they're around. Lateral, shuffle, drop. Everyone take a big inhale. We're beginning in three, two, one. Quick, we're on. Oh goodness. We got two thirds the amount of time to get all the work. So that means we're a firecracker on these. We've seen it, we've done it. Ah, that might mean shuffle down, drop the hips, or, you know, you don't need the quick steps. You could shuffle, drop, shuffle, drop. Three, two, one, lateral lunge. Going heavier as an option. Lateral lunge, bicep curl. Can't be duplicated or recycled. Exercise has to change, but how we tackle it might have. Three, two, one, fire dropper. Off the gates, here we go. Huh. Huh. Nice roll. Big step. Push it center. I want you to think of it as a pendulum. That weight transfers out just to swing it back. Quick descent. That outside leg does the push. Yeah, but stick it through in the center. Relax. Fight thread the needle. Fight thread. On the floor. Ready. Set. Here we go. Go. On. My golly. That 30 seconds feels like a whole new world, a whole new island, a whole new hill. So the things that you were like, maybe I should conserve, now is the time to give it all up. Good. Five seconds to go, team. Three, two, one. Forward back. Wait in. Or hopping, jump scoop, up to you how you travel forward and back. Three, two, one, and the type of firecracker, we're on, explosive. Take it all. Go back. Take it all. Up front. Go back. In three, two, one. Relax. Swing. Send this. The time to lighten up maybe a little. Go quicker or try to swing. Our marks. Get set. Go. You are swinging. The torso is slightly pitched forward here. Your roots are grounding you from the 
Ready, set, here we go! 
into nothing but challenge for those 20 seconds. It might take us a couple seconds to get into it, but we're gonna start with that lateral shuffle. A couple options to get you into that challenge zone. Quick hops, staying low, or friends who have that weight, you're just here. Quick tap, okay? High turnover or going heavy will get you in that challenge round. Enough talking, more doing. Short, steep hill, beautiful climb. On your marks, get set, go. Okay, team, so we're hopping side to side, moving laterally, or adding that tap. By golly, we only have 10 seconds to go. So, really stay low. It's like you're fighting them off. Five seconds now. Three, two, laterals, laterals. Now, it's still 15 seconds rest, but if you're ready to go, I want you to go. This time, the timer is suggestion. 20 seconds of work. We are going to go 
right into the next exercise. Every time. There will be a 15 second place holder. Or if you want to grab water or take that time to set up. The five seconds you're allowed to lunge already. Up next. Plank thread the needle. Jumping jacks, 
Four press. Set it up. Happy recovery. Three, two, one, go. Add a load or add that press. Come on. We're on. Go. My mind says go. My body says what? Ugh. Yes, that's we got. Because that's what we got. Three, two, one, fly. Fly. After the cover, you can make no way. No way. Soak it up for five seconds. Drop the weight. Here we go. you're changing or going to where you need to go, drink plenty of water. Friends who are staying with me will be about two minutes, two to three minutes here on the floor and standing until we close out. Woo, way to get it. Way to get it. Nice, go back to that first side, knee to chest. Draw that knee across the chest. Nice, pure form this hip stretch here. 30 seconds. Just 
Great week. 